In a bid to promote agribusiness and foster inclusive growth in Nigeria's agricultural sector, stakeholders and the industry have sought to create and ensure inclusivity by sharing and managing insights and practices across the country. They called on government, actors and policy makers to play a significant role in promoting agribusiness by implementing measures that will address the challenges peculiar to the sector. Here's the rest of the report. In a country where agriculture remains the largest sector, contributing an average of 24% to the nation's GDP over the past seven years, the need to address challenges and maximize the potential for growth is crucial. Today's stakeholders in the agricultural sector at the Inclusive Agribusiness Club meeting in Abuja provide strategies for promoting agribusiness and creating an enabling environment. The Registrar of the Institute of Agribusiness Management of Nigeria, Ayodele Olorunfemi, emphasized the importance of the initiative in facilitating networking opportunities and promoting collaborations among farmers, private sector actors, policy makers and development workers, among others. Agribusiness is better when it is inclusive, when it captures um, farmers, when it captures processors, when it captures women, when it captures everyone that should be involved in um, agribusiness. We, we would want to encourage our policymakers to adopt inclusive agribusiness model within their scope of practice. Um, we just um, want to ensure that agribusiness can be an enabler for prosperity. And for us to make agribusiness an enabler for prosperity, we need to make sure that it is, it is inclusive. It captures every actors and every players within the ecosystem. Hoping that the new government that will be inaugurated on the 29th of May can build on the achievements of the previous administration and then take our agribusiness to the next level, a level where we can be competitive with other countries, a level where we can be sustainable in food production as a nation, and a level where we can drive our foreign revenue from agricultural production. The program director to scale Marina Diboma spoke about the need to prioritize actions that will promote agribusiness sector and creating an enabling environment by the supportive policies. Uh, private sector, uh, in that sense, is uh, has a uh, uh, role, a central role to play there to make sure that uh, these actors not only um, can increase their productivity, but also they can uh, increase their income for the long, for the short and long uh, uh, term. It's important that there are uh, local policies that are really uh, um, are conducive for. Um, uh, a favorable business climate for this private sector and um, yeah and where whereby they can then also play a role in the, the, the way they engage with uh, smallholders farmers. Others stress the significance of government actors and policymakers playing a significant role in implementing measures that will address the challenges faced by the agribusiness in Nigeria. Now using this PPP, we are able to include women in supply chain. We are able to make supply chain more efficient and transparent. We are also able to bring employment to youths, to create access to nutritious food for BOP consumers, to improve the voice, ownership and reward system in actors working in a particular value chain. Ordinarily, youth are excluded in the agribusiness, but when you see that uh, the, there is technology in agriculture you, that will in, encourage them. It will be like an impetus for them to actually to attract them to agribusiness. One of the proposed strategies discussed at the meeting was the formation of private-public partnership to address these challenges effectively.